Best you niggas keep them songs you working on We heard it all, supposed to nod my head But I'm just nodding off What's a king to a god? Cause I'm the reason niggas rap this way The devil don't create, he just manipulates Peace to the leaders, achievers, hip-hop believers and future seers Welcome to it It is another edition of Raps Reviewed Brought to you by SA Hip Hop on the Grizzly Grind My name is The Overwrite, the man who controls the hype And the track that we are gonna be looking at Is a new release from A. Reese With a song titled God Save the King God Save the King, God Save the King Bow kiss the ring, God God save the king, yeah. God save the king, God save the king. Bow, kiss the ring, God save the king, yeah. God save the king. Alright, so before we get started, man, can we please um do the most by hitting the like button, hitting the subscribe, and also the notification bell as well, just to like you know, it basically helps our channel and lets other people know that you know that we're doing our thing. You know what I'm saying? So now when it comes to the whole production side of things, man, I see Mr. A Reese put on another guy by the name of um Logical Rhymes, man. Um, first and foremost, bro, shout out to the whole um beat selection, bro. I love how it was a combination of um boom bap and had a little bit of you know new age trap elements and all that right i love how um the trap sounds gave it that fast pace but then you can still tell how the bpm was still a uh, classical um boom bap uh, kind of sound you know what i'm saying kind of style or kind of speed and all that you know what i'm saying and um with this beat in particular bro this is something that definitely complements um a reese because this is a kind of beat that's specifically for mcs you know what i'm saying bro like i can actually picture stogie i'm um, jumping on this and we're going to talk about stogie's influence on the rhymes i'm um, just now but yeah like you have to be a spitter when you jump on this man you know what i'm saying so now in terms of the production um big shout out to you bro um with regards to the whole thing man so when it comes to the whole lyrical content situation man um I'm not really surprised anymore at like what Aries can do, man. Like I'm just always sitting, listening in anticipation for the next, ah, you know, ah. Stop it. Get some help. I love how, like, and I always say this, man. I love how he is simple in his approach, but then he's still clear on what it is he's saying and all that, man. Like I love um, schemes were it and all that, you know, um, the punchlines, man, the punchlines, bro. Fuck the punchlines, dog. Self-employed, put myself in charge. CEO. It's about how much I got and not how much I charge. Shouldn't even be involved in this thing of ours. This ain't body art, it's wall paint over these battle scores. I actually got um the same feeling that I got when I heard the song um yeah, Stogie T. Um it was, it's the first song on his um Empire of Sheep tape. It's called um Kill the King. And um, yeah, man, in terms of like the style and the way in which, um, you know, Reese jumped on and all that stuff, man, you know, there's definitely like a lot of like Stogie T influence there, man. It's laughable, you rapper dudes are barely passable. Cats out the back, can't tell the woods from the master stroke. And they gon' tell you rapper points ain't backable. I can show you a life I bought from parables I record. Man, like I heard, I heard you in a rhyme say that like, yeah, man, um, um, you the reason most people rap like this, but it sounds to me like Stogie T is the reason why you rap like this, bro. You know what I'm saying? And um, yeah, man, like no shade, bro. Like, but yeah, man, like um, yeah, you just gotta acknowledge, man, where you get your steez from. You know what I'm saying? And but over and above that, bro, like yeah, man, like the those two verses were incredible, bro. And like um, it's also quite funny that like the name of that song, yeah, Stogie is called um, Kill the King. And then the song that you dropped is like, you know, God bless the king and all that, you know. Um, yeah, man, yeah, we do our homework. We do our homework. <laughs> so now when it comes to the whole overall feeling situation, man, like, um, ah, dog, Reese stays blessing me, man. It was a really good comeback as well, man, after like... I, I, I won't say a lackluster tape because um, Aries did do the most, man. It was just his brother that, man, like... I think these brothers should like rap with delays or something, you know what I'm saying? I think they'd be, they'd actually like, you know, make good music to, together. Because now when you mix bars with like just swag and whatnot, doesn't. But like, yeah, this one, you really came back and you really set the tone for 2022. You know what I mean, man? So shout out to you. And um, the question as to like whether or not the song has substance, um, it definitely does have substance. You know what I'm saying, man? Like, yeah, like I'm saying, you blessed me with this one. You know what I'm saying? And um, based on everything I'm saying, man, I'd like to give you this song a nice um, four out of five, man. You know what I'm saying? 
word up and yeah man that was the review for today how do you feel about this song in particular please let us know on the comment section below and for more on what we really do hip hop on the grind the radio show we air every single wednesday between the hours of 8 to 10 p.m on www.massivemetro.com where we play 100 percent of local upcoming um you know hip-hop music we bridge the gap between the streets and the industry and we're the only show where hard bars do save you man as for me i am the overwrite the man who controls the hype and i'm over and out Word up. God save the king, God save the king, bow kiss the ring, God save the king. Yeah. It's only one God, God it's only one king. king. God save the king, bow kiss the ring, God save the Yeah. <laughs> yeah.